An undergrad class project could be medicine's next big thing. Five students at Rice University created an EpiPen that you can wear on your wrist. This way, the medicine is always accessible for people with allergies. Sugarland native Albert Hahn says he came to Rice to study engineering. The bonus he found is lifetime friends with similar interests. As we kind of got to know each other better and work with each other a little bit more, we got to kind of complement each other's strengths and weaknesses. One of his friends, Justin Tang, says he has a severe peanut allergy. And like many who need an EpiPen for emergencies, he admits he doesn't carry it because it's bulky. And once on vacation, that was almost a deadly mistake. You can imagine the, the fear in my, in my mom's eyes when she realized that I didn't have my EpiPen on me and that we were in some foreign country that we didn't know like what proper medical procedures were and if I could get the medical attention I needed. With that information, this group of friends combined their brains and bond to invent something better. An injection device so portable it could fold in three pieces, fit inside a watch, and from that, EpiWare was born. That was a very I guess, exciting moment for us because coming from scratch, we didn't actually expect anything to work. And it does, but Jacob Matea says it's still a work in progress. For one, they want to make it with slimmer materials and potentially save consumers more than just peace of mind for carrying it. But another aspect of it is looking at the market, how can we find a way uh, to kind of present an option that might be more affordable for patients as well. It seems like an ambitious goal since it could potentially improve the lives of thousands of people, but they're succeeding with a narrow focus on one close friend. So the watch is not available to the public. Rice University tells me the students plan to continue working on this project this fall, and then when they finalize their design, then they can apply for FDA approval. Pretty yeah, impressive, it's Phil. Obviously, it's a process, but boy, what a great idea. Absolutely. It's just fascinating.